And I'm proud to say that every woman that's in the legislature at this time is a part of this honorary Troop 49. <laughs> And then all the other people that are part of this, I'm so glad to see that you're here. I'm always energized when I have young people around me. They've always been around me. I've never been a Girl Scout. Didn't have that opportunity. But I've been a den mother. And my daughter was Girl Scout. My granddaughter's Girl Scout. So I've been involved with the Girl Scout for many, many, many years, even though I've never had that opportunity to be one. It's so good that we have the opportunity to mentor these young ladies, to help them in many ways that you not, not can't even think about what we're going to provide for them. I was just sharing with the group on Saturday that when I was on the school board, I used to go and the young girls would be running for secretary of their school. Uh, and they would never try to run for the president because they thought they couldn't do it or didn't have the skills. But you know, when you keep saying something to them about, hey, why don't you try doing this? Maybe you want to want to run for president. Over the years, the girls will come to me and tell me, I'm now running for vice president or president or treasurer. They would move from secretary because all they ever thought about was maybe we could be the secretary. We could be almost anything we want to be, just set our mind to it. And I want you to have that kind of attitude. And we're so glad to have these young folks with us. I know we don't have much time, and I know you need to hear from some other people, but I hope that Troop 49 would just be an inspiration for other troops to be designed to provide the same thing that you're gonna do in Troop 49. And thank you for having me here, and uh, it's my pleasure. Thank you.